let's look at how to use M Auto Dynamic EQ with an external sidechain trigger. So far we've looked at the use of the input signal as the sidechain trigger. However, we can also route an external sidechain trigger into the plugin, which can then be used to activate our Dynamics processing. You're probably already familiar with sidechain compression. As an example, the process of, say, using a kick signal to trigger compression over another sound, like a bass line, to duck it out the way each time a kick drum hits. M Auto Dynamic EQ allows you to do this type of processing, but in a frequency specific context. So here is a practical example of that. We've used our doors routing to route a duplicate of this kick channel into an instance of M Auto Dynamic EQ, which is loaded as an insert on our basis channel. Both the Melder production manual and your doors manual will give you specific external routing instructions for your own door. We've set up a low shelf EQ band on the bass channel, but it's not cutting any frequencies just yet. Now, by activating the sidechain button in the band settings menu, we can see that the plugin is now using this external signal as the sidechain input for this band. And we can observe this on the level meter. In the advanced menu, we can listen to the sidechain signal using the bandpass section's listen button. At the minute, our plugin is filtering the sidechain signal in relation to the low shelf we've set up. So we can only hear these low frequencies of our external sidechain. But we can change settings as we like. Now, as we pull down the dynamics parameter, our EQ band is triggered by the sidechain input. It's then easy to adjust settings to remove as much or as little frequency content as you like from the baseline. And we can also adjust attack and release times to give this a more rhythmic effect. And this is just one example. This technique is also ideal for more transparent sidechain equalization. So you might have a kick with a fundamental frequency of 50 Hertz. And by using this method, you can route that kick to this plugin and transparently notch out 50 Hertz from your bass part, but only when each kick fires. Download over 30 exclusive plugins. Get hundreds of pro quality samples and power up your production skills with in depth tutorials. We break it down for you step by step and you'll see exactly how it's done in expert video guides and producer masterclass sessions with pro producers. Get all this and more with Computer Music Magazine every month on iPad and iPhone, PC and Mac, Android and in print.